All right, let's hit it. Let's do it. It's cold out here. We're going to start moving. Ready? Do our work quick warm ups. You can jog in place for your warm up, <laughs> but we'll do our next circles. So we're going to do 40 seconds of work today, 20 seconds of rest. Keep ourselves moving. Let's go the other direction. And I would say we're going to, we're going to do five moves and we're going to go roll through them four times. Do big arm circles and do any modification you want. I'll talk about all different types, but you can do it as slower, as fast, or as harder, as easy as you want. All right, other direction. Ooh, nice big stretch. Feel like a tiny bit protected from the wind, but I know. Oh, right. <laughs> and got some goosebumps. Let's do some lunges. It's only gonna get better from here. Yeah, that's the nice. Thing. <laughs> Don't get it because it's snow in August or like something like that. Like, what, what do you think? Snow in August. <laughs> All right, let's bend down, touch our toes. Ready? Touch our toes. Nice, easy. Bending at the waist. Perfect. Got body moving. Last one will be some twists. And then we'll start our moves here, about 30 seconds. So we'll start that first one running in place or high knees. Nice big twist. All right, so you're gonna do that run in place. So you're gonna do those high knees. So if you're doing high knees, you can go two at a time. If we're gonna do running in place, last 10 to 15 seconds, we're gonna take it up a notch, okay? So we've just gotta really keep moving. We have 10 seconds. Water. Right. Let's go. Okay, knees up. Perfect. Those knees moving, feet moving, arms pumping. Floor is engaged. Check in. You go up and down on your mat. Make it interesting. Woo! Backwards, forward. Remember, we got 40 seconds. It's going to feel a little bit longer, even though it's just five seconds. Ooh, already a jacket's coming out. <laughs> I love it. All right, last 10, let's take it up and go. Come on, you got it, a little faster. A little bit faster. All right, so next we'll go into squats. So we'll start with a nice, easy squat. So, oh, another jacket's coming off already, I love it. So you're just gonna nice and easy. Bend down, stand up, back straight, take them to the ground. This one's just nice and easy. You're going to exhale on your way down. Ready? Try to think about getting deep as you can. Butt's not out. Your sacrum's going down to the ground. Weight's on your heels. You should be able to wiggle your toes. Nice. Now, if you want for the last 10 seconds of this one, you can just do little pulses or hold it. Try to do a modification for each one if we can. All right, ready? Whatever you want to do. If you want to hold it, you can even raise your heels. Maybe try to raise both heels. Nice. Engage that core. That's awesome. Perfect. All right, let's go down. We'll do a plank. So we'll start with dolphin. So you'll be on your elbows. Kind of tripod with your hands together. If you want a modification the whole time, you can lift your feet. Or we'll just do that the last 10 seconds. But for now, you're in dolphin plank, so your butt's down. Try to think of your spine as a flat as a board. Your gaze is about six inches in front of your fist. Engage that core, squeeze that belly button back towards the ceiling of the sky. You got it. And then nice, easy breath. Now, if you want in about five seconds, we can start to raise a leg. So go ahead and shift to the right, raise your right leg. Or, sorry, shift to the left, raise your right leg. Shift to the right, raise your left leg. Nice and easy. Perfect. All right, let's stay down. We'll do some abs. My favorite misnomer, the toe touch, where we don't touch our toes. All right, so we're going to have our 
feet up and hands up towards the ceiling of the sky. And you're going to engage your upper core. Engage, reach towards your toes. Ready? And reach and down. Just that upper core. Exhale when you're reaching. Down. Beautiful. Reach. Really isolate that upper core. We're going to work all of our core muscles. Beautiful. Keep going. All right. And if you want to hold it, you can hold it for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Hold it. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Woo. Feel that. Okay. Let's hop up. We'll do a reverse lunge. So the last move. It's going to be a full body. So we'll do, I'll sit here so I can see the timer. <laughs> All right, so we're going to step back and up. So if you want a modification off the bat, bring your knee up. Or you can do that for the last 10 seconds. Or just do nice and easy reverse lunge. The key here is engage that core so you're not really wobbly. Exhale when you go down. So if you do a knee up, your last 10 seconds, you're going to add the jump. <laughs> you don't have to. <laughs> so if you're doing Leah, you're going to add that jump the last 10 seconds. All right, so whatever you've been doing, add a little bit, either a knee up or a jump. Don't forget to breathe. Engage that core. Almost there. Last one. All right, round two. We're going to run in place, throw some punches. See what you guys got today. Ready? <laughs> Is she cold? Who knows? <laughs> All right, let's do it. Throw those punches. So knees up, core engaged. Get those arms moving. I do like the forward and the backward. If you guys are up for a little backwards running, it definitely uses different muscles. Takes it up a little bit. All around the circle. <laughs> and tickle the kid in there. <laughs> All right, let's go a little faster. You missed the 10 seconds, get five seconds. Okay, squat pulse. Pulse, pulse, and up. Or you can just kind of stay and do those little pulses. We'll do those last 10 seconds for sure though. All right, five seconds. Does go fast, that 20 second rest. Keep moving. And, oh, you're gonna get strong doing your squat carrying a kid. Look at that. It's like a ride at Disney. I wanna be on. <laughs> that ride. Pulse, pulse up, beautiful. Don't forget to breathe. Weights on your heels. All right, last 10 seconds, we're gonna stay down, do those little tiny pulses like they do in bar class. Come on, little tiny movements. Feel it, feel the first. Perfect, okay, bicycles. Oh, no, squat, plank, plank. We'll do plank, plank. All right, high plank. So let's say you're up in high plank. And if you want, you can touch the shoulder for the last 10 seconds. So let's just stay in high plank now. So high plank. So look at your form up on your toes. Your shoulders are over your wrist creases. Your back straight. This is not downward dog. Our butt's not up. Back, butt down. Kind of pushing your hip bones towards the floor. Nice, easy breath. Your, your gaze is about 18 inches in front of your hand, so you're not cranking on your neck. Beautiful. When you do something like a shoulder tap, you lean to the opposite side. We're going to lean left, tap with your right. Lean right, tap with your left. Nice and easy. Just try one or two. Beautiful. Okay. All right. Bicycles. So we're gonna alternate elbow to knee with a bicycle. So 
Now exhale when your elbow touches your knee. All right, ready? We're gonna do three, two, one, go. Kick that leg out. Love it. Keep going. Kick those legs out. Don't forget to breathe. Exhale when your elbow touches your knee. Come on. Keep going. 10 seconds left. You got this. The 40 seconds felt long. Okay. Mountain climbers, our full body for the second round is a mountain climber. So you're in high plank. And this time you're bringing in knee to an elbow, but the same side. And you can go as slow or as fast as you want. So the nice thing about this is your butt can be up in the air. This is not a plank. Almost in like a bear crawl, hunched over position. Just bring that knee up. Exhale when your knee comes up. Keep those shoulders over your wrist. I always want to drift back. And if you want for the last 10 seconds, you'll go a little faster. You'll pick up that cadence a teeny bit. I'll let you know when. Okay, ready? 10, nine, eight, seven, six, come on. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, halfway through. Good. Let's run in place, climb the roof. <laughs> The squeals of joy at a hip workout. Love it. Woo. All right, we're going to climb the rope. You're going to climb that rope, Lord? Let's go. Come on. Hold down. Nice. Upward and backwards. Hold down. Grab the rope and pull. Working those triceps. Beautiful. Keep going. All right, three seconds. You're going to go a little faster. Faster. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. All right, our squat. We all do squat hold. So we're just going to go down. Now go wide, as wide as you can. You just find your stance, you're gonna hold it. Last 10 seconds, we'll do the heel raises. You guys ready? Put your arms wherever you're comfortable. Prayer is kind of nice. Some people like out front. Check your position. Sacrum's going down to the ground. Core is engaged. Back straight, you're not leaning forward. Back straight. Weights on your heels, wiggle your toes. You all wiggling, I like it. Perfect. Yay. Hold it there, feel it. Feel it, feel it. Keep breathing, get your air to the muscles. All right, 10 seconds left. So raise a heel, you can raise both, you can stay. Now that cause, that makes, that requires a lot of Yeah, exactly. Okay, nice. All right, plank. We're gonna do side planks, you guys. Sorry, Deb. <laughs> huh? like you do. Okay. I just think you always, you have a good idea. I think of your elbows. What makes me think. So sometimes people roll over the mat. I didn't talk about it. So you're stacked up. You're going to push your hip up towards the ceiling. Now you can have a foot in front of you or a hand in front of you. So the idea is this not, we're not static. We're going up and down. You're working those. Now you're talking girls, I love it. Really push that hip up towards the ceiling. You got it. Almost there. 10 seconds left. Push up that, push that hip up. Exhale, I love it. Almost there. Last one. Oh, yay. <laughs> All right, let's do a reach around for abs. So this one we're going to work our lower. 
abs. So this time we're gonna crunch lower abs, reach our hand around the back of our knee. So, so last time we did upper. Now you're really gonna isolate your lower abs. Touch your hands behind your knees and exhale when your fingers touch. And down, engage, touch and down. You got it. Almost there. I keep forgetting to turn around to look at the clock. All right, you have 10 seconds left. If you want to hold it and not engage, keep tapping those fingers. Five, four, three, two, one. Woo! Nice. Are you guys want to stay down? We'll do a little butt press up. Give yeah. ourselves a little break. <laughs> All right, let's see here. So, knees are up, hands flat to your sides. Engage those glutes. Press up, come down. Last 10 seconds, we'll hold it. Ready? And go. So, exhale when you press your glutes. Squeeze those glutes and exhale. Nice. You got it, girls. Almost there. Squeeze those glutes. Engage those butt muscles. Weights on your heels. Your toes are even um, sometimes up off the ground. All right, in three seconds, you're gonna hold. Ready and hold. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Nice. All right, last round. Yay, let's do it. All right, so this one I'm thinking we'll do a Instead of running in place, a little cross under our knees, a little cheer, a little skip, hop, and a jump. Shake it up a little bit. Ready? And go. A little bit of both. I think so. Oblique, so engage, tap, 
tap and down. You're actually engaging your whole core. Engage, tap, tap, and down. Now, last 10 seconds, you'll stay up and engage. Engage, tap, tap. <laughs> Exhale when you tap. Engage, tap, tap, and down. At this rate, we're all going to have six taps by summer. You laugh, but I'm serious. Okay, for the last 10 seconds, which we're going to come up here in about five seconds, you can stay up and engaged. Ready? And go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Come on, feel the burn. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. All right, last move. So you guys know what it is. Hey, we're just all of a sudden. We're like, no. <laughs> All right, so you know it down, step or jump back, throw the push up in if you want, step or jump forward. Clap. 40 seconds. Let's go. Down, jump or step back. Perfect. You got it. <laughs> Burpees with a baby on your back. <laughs> You're doing B and B's. You're over halfway, guys. Almost there. Probably about three left. Ten seconds. Woo! Okay, last one. Woo! You definitely warmed up. Thanks, you guys.